Look at this view. This is the reason you come out here. Good morning, everyone. This is our last day here, and we'll be leaving soon. But before we do, we're just gonna check out the beach. Water's pretty clear, but it's also pretty cold. But it's good because the sun is out, so it's a little refreshing. It's not as windy as it was yesterday. Okay, we've come to an interesting fork in the road, quite literal. This is right and this is left. Hey everyone, we left Amasra and we are now here at Guzel Jehisar. The good thing is that there's no one here, so let's take a look. I would recommend if you have time and if you have a car, just come out here because it was only about 45 minute drive from Amasra. So if you're out here in the region, you might as well take a look. Yeah, there's only street uh, food vendors here and the ones who rent out boats, but there's no tourists. We don't know if it's normally like this or if it's just because it's a Monday. So now that we're closer, you can see some of the rock formations. They're pretty dramatic. We're going to go up here to that um, the lookout. Then we'll go to the one at the very end. On the drive over here, this place actually reminded us a lot of California. And we were reading that these type of formations, because of the lava, are actually also in California. So it's interesting that not only do they look the same, but they have some of the same geological background. So that's interesting. So now we're heading to this viewing platform up there. It's not too long of a walk from where we were back out there but just wanted to point out that if you remember when there was that fork in the road if you go down the right side you will actually end up to this spot where there's actually at least from what i see not that much parking but you are closer to this platform if you go to the left side you end up at the actual parking spot where you can uh, sort of get out and you're at the middle of this location so you can go to the left side for that other platform or to the right side for this one so if you're in a car i would recommend you go left and then you can just park and then explore on foot. So you can see this is the other parking spot and it's not really developed. So definitely go try and park on the other side. Those of you thinking of visiting Turkey, know that there's plenty to see and there's a lot of things that a lot of people don't think of when they think of Turkey. This being one of them. Of course you think of this maybe on the south shore, but this is in the north of Turkey and it's still beautiful. The weather's great. We just stopped at this place right by the road. It was maybe a 45 minute drive from where we were. We're gonna have some food here, some lunch, and then we're heading back to Ankara. I have like picnic tables out here by the mountain, super green. It's a little stream that runs close to the restaurant and it's right by where we're eating. So I'll show you in a bit. As I mentioned, we're really close to this little stream. You can be right by it. There's some animals, some ducks. It's really nice. Yeah, it was a good choice. And I found it online. It's just right by the road. So if you don't know about it, you might miss it. But otherwise, it's a place we would recommend if you can find it. I got the kasharla toast. It's like a panini with cheese. Comes with fries and some veggies. Then we also ordered the gozlemez. We're gonna split it. And Eddie got a grilled sausage. And they offered this as part of our meal with tea, of course. Get in, I'll push you. So this place is cool because it's not only a restaurant, but it's also like a little park. They have this little stream that goes right here. The sound of the water with the rocks, it's very relaxing. They have some swings, some things for kids, chickens and stuff. Just a 
good time for you to be out here relaxing. We're an hour and a half away from the beach that we were at, and it's about a two hour drive to Antara from here. I think this is a place worth coming to. The prices are good too, I think, for the, amount of the food. It's all really fresh, and I'm sure breakfast here would be great too. So we'll just walk around, show you a bit of the area, and then we're gonna head out. I just ate, I wanna feel nauseous after. Okay. I'm getting nauseous. I see the chicken coop from here. So it was interesting because we were sitting there and then they saw us with the camera and uh, one of the workers stopped by and he was like, oh, are you YouTubers? Uh, but then he wanted us to take some photos and some videos. But overall, I just want to say we really enjoyed this place. It's uh, like a little hidden gem. There isn't much else around here, but it's worth coming here, especially if you're already on the way. That's it for the weekend. We're going back to Ankara. So just subscribe, make sure you tune in for our other videos and we'll see you next time.